All right, and we're back with our uh, double header. We've got Upchurch, Adam Calhoun, off the Hooligan album. Sephram? I, uh, isn't that like a bad angel or something? I don't know. i got to look up what that word. I'm not positive what that word means. I thought it was. Well, let's hear what the song's about. Maybe we can figure it out. I die when I do. Let it roll, let it roll. God forbid I die, but when I do, remember me. Don't feel blue, it's been a hell of a ride. Scars and tattoos, I did my time. In prison too, but I survived and I still do It's gonna be hard killing me, motherfucker, cause I'm that dude <laughs> Ride till the wheels fall off that train Did, did he say we, you gotta go to ride, ride till the wheels fall off that bus? Is that what he said? Is that what he just said? Hard killing me, motherfucker, cuz I'm that dude. <laughs> Ride till the wheels fall off that train. No, I'm positive I heard that. Ride till the wheels fall off that bus. Yeah, no, that's a good bar. I like that. <laughs> Ride till the wheels fall off that train. Yeah, I talk shit, cuz that's my thing. But I back it up like that. Old girl twerking. Like that, old man working. No, I ain't perfect. Never claimed to be. When I see God, I wonder what to say to me. Man, what's this word? What's this word? Hold on. We're doing something weird. Because I think I, I got that one wrong, uh, didn't I? Uh, what was it? Oh, well, yeah, I'd have to dig deeper, but I, yeah, I knew it was something with an angelic nature. Uh, I'm not hating. I'm not hating. I didn't take anything negative from it. But I just wanted to see if I had a weird misinterpretation of the word. No, no, no. I think we're good. I, I, uh, I really like these lyrics too. Let's go back. This is much better than I expected. And I see God. I wonder what to say to me. in the sky still once upon a time we lived it all up the muscle cars the ladies and the best of drugs and the ladies go gray cars break down years go deaf to the nightlife sound no ah fix your car when it breaks down and learn to love your ladies gray i'm just saying you're gonna get older She's beautiful every day. And that, that broken down car, maybe it's worth fixing. Uh, the muscle cars, the ladies, and the best of drugs, and the ladies go gray. Cars break down. Years go <coughs> deaf to the nightlife sound. No whiskey in my glass. I've had my share of cheers. So here's to the years and the Life after this, I
Okay, now, that's kind of funny. You can just believe I picked it out. You can believe whatever you want. That's the wonder of free will. You're free to sit there and think anything you want to think. We're all able to be wrong. So just say it. Just because we think something doesn't make it right. It just makes us an opinion. My opinions are not worth my rear end or a hole in the ground and are for entertainment purposes only. Yours might be free, uh, shared freely like facts. I don't know. All I do know is this uh, Sephirum off Hooligan up church in Adam Calhoun um was pretty mellow and chill, and that's what we were looking for. Got surprised on the first one. Um, double surprised on this one. And the lyrical content was fantastic. Highly saved. You go back and check those out. If you're looking to, to, to be a little pumped up on what kind of man you are and who you should be, it sounds like that, that hit a lot of nails on the head. Uh, good times. Hey, we're coming back with a couple generics. So we've got uh, a thrash version of Eleanor Rigby coming up soon. Uh, if you're not a thrash person and that Stanley Jordan was the pinnacle of Eleanor Rigby, this one might not be for you. On some slide rules, it'd be the completely other end of the scale. For me, I thought it was pretty good. And then uh, freewheel burning from a, a blocked or um, denied reaction. And I think we stuck on just Judas Priest being kick ass. I think we're saving it all for uh, our retrospective. So I think it was actually a pretty good uh, reaction, uh, review, rant, whatever you want to call it. I obviously heard the song for 30 years. So it's not like it was fresh and new. I just, I never understood that, how something could be steeped in popular culture, but you tune into a channel and they're like, I've never heard this before. Did you live in a cage underground in a hole buried in dirt? You know, I mean, where, how did you not hear this? Like certain songs permeate society. It doesn't matter if you like it or not. You've heard it. Why? Because it's at every sporting event or every commercial or every, you know, the moment they start putting Zeppelin on commercials, you, you should probably realize they've sold out your angst and rebellion for profit. Just saying. Hey, I've been me. I want you to be the best you you can be if you're willing. And um, like I said, I hate to say this all the time, but yeah. Maybe go back to helping little old ladies across the street. They still need our help.